He's okay. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not great. I'm just wanted to be cautious. So at least he's fine. And, and Timo? He rolled his ankle uh, yesterday at practice. But he's okay, though. It's the same thing. Just being cautious. Jason Hardison. Oh, <laughs> he tweaked his groin in the last game. Uh, so uh, he's feeling better, feeling good. And uh, same thing, being cautious. What was it like playing in Seattle in front of all the fans? What did you think of the experience? I thought it was great. You know, I thought it was great um, to actually come out and cheer the way you did for two teams that's you know, not from Seattle. You know, um, it shows you how much um, this city, you know, needs a team. It shows you how much, how passionate they are about the game of, of basketball. And so um, just having that fan support, you know, for both teams, you know, really made the environment really, really fun to play in. And so, like I said, it was just, it was good to come back and play here. Um, since I've been here since 2008. What do you think about what you thought? I thought Kawhi did a great job. Yeah, I like you. Yeah, I know what you're going to ask. <laughs> yeah, I was going to actually say the whole first game, which yeah, Kawhi right. is a part of. There are <laughs> more guys, and you just jumped the gun. But yeah. But you no, like Kawhi, though? No, I thought um, our first unit did a good job defensively, you know, coming out trying to set the tone defensively. Um, you know, Dane missed a couple easy shots, maybe on the mix, but, you know, it's preseason. But, uh, for the most part, I thought we did a great job of shrinking shrinking the court. I thought we did a great job of our stunning sticks. Um, our bigs were terrific tonight. And so um, just continue to, keep, to build off that defensive of energy. You know, that's, one of, that's, one of the, that's what our mindset has to be every single night. And um, the team we have with Kawhi and PG coming back, uh, which should be great defensively. So um, that's our main focus. But you know, offensively for Kawhi, I thought you know, he got a little tired. Uh, but he got some shots he, he, know, he normally makes. But, just seeing him out there on the floor just makes a big difference for our team. So just happy about that. You know, PG is energy. You know, shot the ball well. Defensively was really good. And so, you know, with Nico being a start of the game and guard Dane to start the game, I thought it was huge for us as well. So um, just something that we got to continue to keep building off of and going forward. How do you assess uh, how, how John came in and uh, made, made his impact after his uh, long? I just thought he just let the game come to him. I thought he did a good job with just running our sets and what we were looking to run and just trying to get guys involved. So, um, you know, um, with a point guard like that who can score the basketball, but also can get guys in their spots and, and uh, be able to, you know, run our sets is great. You know, because come out of training camp, he's only been here for you know, four practices, but he knows all the plays, one through five, and that's what a, you know, a true point guard does. He can get everyone in the right spots and get guys shots. And so, um, like I said, he didn't try to force an issue tonight. I thought he did a great job just trying to run our offense. Thank you, guys. Well, thank you. Well, come on, Andrew. I know you got some. <laughs> <laughs> With um, caught twice, and you know he doesn't play five on five in normal offseason, let alone when he's coming back from an injury. Like, how does that change how you how much five on five you do play with him in the preseason as you ramp him up, getting him minutes, preseason games? Do you have to be more cautious with him than you would a guy who plays all summer? No, I think the biggest thing is just, you know, seeing how he feels, seeing how, he, how his body feels. You know, same thing with John, just making sure that, you know, we haven't played uh, in 15 months. And so just making sure we're doing the right thing by the player, you know, not for our personal gain. We've got to make sure that, you know, um, we protect those guys from themselves so they do want to play more than um, they possibly should be playing. So, um, you know, as long as their body tells us that they're fine, our medical team is great, you know, you know listening to those guys as well. So make sure we're doing the right by the player. The kind of the backup point guard play you're talking about, um, you know, Norm had the ball in his hand a little bit. PG has been assist. What do you make of those two guys? Well, I didn't do it much tonight. It was just I'm saying going forward, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna try it a little bit, and um, you know, just kind of see how it looks. Um, I try to get the six nine lineup across the board out there just a couple times, see how that looks as well. We go with uh, PG, Kawhi, Nico, Marcus, and Nico, you know, and just kind of see how that looks defensively. And, um, spread the floor, so we just gotta learn how to play that way. That's style of basketball, which we haven't done a lot of those Kawhi guys from two years ago. So last year was hard for us to do, but we'll, we'll, we'll be good at it. Did everyone come out tonight? Okay, except for Luke. Well, I mean, he's fine though, but yeah, just want to be cautious. Thanks, Thanks. 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 Thanks.